Hey family, it's me Lakeisha Marie and welcome back to my channel. So today is going to be a hair video. I am going to talk about my Ghana braids that I have and how I took care of them over the last month. This is my second set of Ghana braids and I'm absolutely loving them. The husband is loving them as well. So I just want to come in here and do a quick video about my braids. So if the video is a little crooked, don't adjust your screens because it could be me. I just can't figure out how to get the, com the camera straight. Okay, anyway, um, I got family coming to pick me up. So, um, like I said, these are Ghana braids. And they're called Ghana braids because they're not um, cornrows per se. Because they start off in a different um, braiding style and then it ends in an actual corn roll and it took about an hour and 10 minutes to uh, for her to braid these these particular set of Ghana braids because of the size if you watch my previous um, vlogs then you see that the braids are a little bigger and because they were bigger the braids didn't last as long even though I had them in for about a month I probably needed, needed to get them redone at the three, third week mark so I got them smaller this time so I can go a longer period of time with wearing the braids before I get them redone again now my goal is to keep my hair braided up until my birthday which is in September and we'll see how that goes and then I'll just get the braids redone every four weeks um, what's the original plan but now that I have them and they're a little smaller we're gonna see if I can stretch it out to about six weeks so um, but yeah but these braids have been super convenient like I said it only took an hour for her to um, do the braids and they are really easy to take out as well so the products that I use to um, take care of my scalp and to make sure that my hair my hair is moisturized while wearing these braids um, are these products here now this first product that I'm about to show you is a little different from the type of products that I normally use on my natural hair and the reason why I bought this product is because for some reason I've just been having really really bad scalp and dandruff all of a sudden I don't know what's going on with my scalp and I haven't quite figured it out yet so in the first set of Ghana braids um, my hair was started my scalp was starting to really flake up and get those white flakes and dandruff or whatever and it wasn't even a week I had my braids in. So I was like, let me get something um, to actually grease my scalp because the oils that I use, that I normally use when I'm just, you know, wearing a um, braid out or wash and go, just wasn't working. And that product is this right here. This is the Runner Brothers Extra Light Double Strength Super Growth, Super Grow with Vitamin E sage and sulfur so this is what i this is what i got and like i said i normally don't buy products like this because this product has petroleum mineral oil and all types of uh sulfates right yeah so it has petroleum and mineral oil which is something that i decided to stay away from when i first went natural but hey i need to um make sure my scalp stays intact when I'm wearing these braids. Now, at first, I was um, going to get, what was it? I think it's Sulfur 8, and it's medicated. I was going to get that because I felt as though I needed something that was medicated, but I didn't like the smell. Um, this one smells a whole lot better than the um, Sulfur 8 that I was going to get. So I decided to go ahead and go with the Bronner Brothers. And so far, it has been really, it has been really, really working. And so this right here is a brand new product that um, I started using. It's not a new product on the market. Like this has been around for a minute, probably way back when natural hair really started to become popular. This um, line of products has been out, but this is my first time actually using it. And it's the Oyen Juices and Berries nourishing herbal leave-in hair tonic this right here is amazing and it is black owned as well so you know i'm all about black owned and all about um supporting the sister because the sister made this product so i'm super excited about this product because it kept my hair really 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 moisturized and it smells it smells so good guys and it's so light because i wanted something that was really really um light and misty you see how it kind of sprays out and it doesn't spray out like um like um 
what's the name of my my lead band? You know what I'm talking about. Um, what is it? Anyway, I can't think of the lead band right now, but I'll put it around on the screen somewhere. But if you see my uh, my videos, you know exactly what I'm talking about. But I wanted something that was more like a moisturizing spray, and this was amazing. Now, I did use the Juices and Berries more than I used the... Um, the Super Grow, the Super Grow I used when I felt as though I used it depending on how my scalp was doing that day. But this I tried to use at least every other day. I was spraying my hair, and so when I took the braids out last night, my hair was so moisturized. Like I was amazed. It was so moisturized. That's the right reason why I decided to do this video so I could share this information with you guys because it was amazingly moisturize now i will say that it was a little bitty a little bit um sticky just a little bit and i'm assuming that it's from this but other than that my hair was super super moisturized and it, the detangling the process was super easy okay i had the braids in for a month and my shedding was at a minimum like for real i expected a whole bunch of shedding and i did not get that and I'm just amazed because right before I got my first set of Ghana braids, you guys know that I use a protein treatment. This one right here, which is the uh, Palmer's Oil Coconut Oil Deep Conditioning Protein Treatment. I did a protein treatment on my hair um, once before getting my braids. Because I was supposed to do it a second time um, the night before I got my braids and I ended up not doing it because I was too tired and I just skipped that process. So I, I did a deep um, condition, deep, so I did a protein deep conditioning treatment on my hair probably like three weeks before getting the braids. And so I'm assuming that the, you know, the lack of shedding, it was helped by this. So I am just like amazed, you guys. So this time when I took my braids out, I made sure to do a protein treatment, but this time I didn't use Palmer's. I used my Aflogene two minute reconstructor and I put it on my hair and just left it on for about 20, 25 minutes with a plastic cap on and then just jumped in the shower and rinsed it out. So I am super excited about my hair. Uh, I'm going to continue to use these products even though I had that sticky tacky feeling. I'm still going to continue to use these products to uh, make sure that my scalp is okay and to also keep my hair moisturized while in the while in the braids. So um, the goal is to try to have, again, is to try to have these braids in for at least six weeks and before I get a new set of Ghana braids. Yeah, that's it. So, if you have any questions in regards to um, Ghana braids, just leave them in the comment section below. Um, these braids cost me $90, just in case you're interested. It cost me $90 to get them done, and that included the hair. Because the um, shop that I go to, they provide the hair, so I don't have to go and buy hair and take it. Um, they provide the hair, so that included hair, $90. So... $90 for an hour and I'm going to keep my hair. Um, I don't have to do my hair for four weeks, four to six weeks. I'm good with that. So yeah, guys, thank you so much for watching this video. Hope you are enjoying your day. Again, if you have any questions, please leave them in the comment section below. If you just now finding my channel for the first time, hello, how are you? Say hello below so I can say hello back. Go ahead and hit that subscribe button and also make sure to ring the bell so you can be notified of new videos as I upload them. Until next time, guys. Peace.